feeling so small Watch the clock ticking off the wall But tonight I'm letting it go Spend Never been so loud before Just trying to make you understand my eyes and hands But you don't even hear my call And you make me wonder who I am Do you know what I see? I see myself cry And say you won't be Say you won't be mad Do you know what I feel? I'm sick of all your lies Just say you want me Say you want me bad. Say you want me bad Hey guys, good morning. Happy Fantabulous Saturday. Uh, yeah, it is crazy. I know I haven't put up a video in about a week and a half, maybe two weeks, I think. The last video was the house update videos. Um, and it's just been hectic. It's been absolutely nuts. <laughs> just trying to unpack the house and getting all the furniture in. Um, I'm going to show you, this is probably gonna be a little lengthy vlog, cause this is vlog style, but I'm gonna show you all that's going on um this weekend today actually i'm going to show you everything that's happening today we're getting our bedroom um our master bedroom set this morning they're supposed to be here at 10 30 i believe um and so i'm also going to give you like an update of the upstairs i think i've given you a slight update of the downstairs i will be doing another update of that um for the most part the downstairs is packed out the only thing that's left um, is just really the dining room. We haven't received like our formal dining room set yet. Um, and then we still have like a few, just maybe five or six more boxes in the living room that we have to unpack. Um, but it, it it's all going to get done this weekend. It's kind of difficult because we work so much and we work long hours throughout the week. And... Um, you know, we work 13 hours a day. So by the time we get home, um, and it's 45 minutes to get home, so by the time we get home, we are literally dog tired and just wanting to come home, take a shower and relax and go to bed. Um, but however, my husband and I, we really did get a lot done. Um, this week that just passed, we got out an old refrigerator that was here and our new refrigerator is in. I'm going to show you guys that. And... Um, my daughter's bedroom is done, uh, about 95% done. Still got to do her floors, but that's not getting done until, I don't know, probably the end of summer. Because um, we do have a lot more pressing things that we have to get done. You probably hear your Gabba Gabba in the background and Nyla freaking out in the background. So, bypass all of that. But I'm going to show you, um, you guys kind of seen in the first clip what my bedroom is looking like and I'm sort of just going to take you guys through me kind of packing out, unpacking some boxes and hanging some stuff up in the closets that we're going to get a brand new closet made. I'm a little stuffy, sorry you guys. But we are going to be putting up a new closet, not putting up, but we're going to be getting a new closet done for us. And I'm going to show you exactly where it's going to be located. Um, we originally had like a different setup for the bedroom. But my original, original setup for the bedroom is what we're going to go with. Because it makes the room bigger. And it allows for all of our windows to still be, you know, to not be hidden by headboards and walls and things like that. And it stays bright, which I love the brightness. So, I'm going to show you guys what we are going to get done today. And also, I'm just going to show you just a little bit of the rooms. I'm not going to do it now because Nyla is butt naked, as always. I think she just has her diaper on and her drawstring shorts. And then Mikey is still sleeping. His room has got to be unpacked, like, totally. But we have to get hangers. 
I haven't even had the chance to go to the store and buy hangers. And the funny thing is, every time I go to Walmart or Target, I forget the hangers. I pick up food, I pick up cleaning supplies, I pick up all that stuff, and I always just forget the hangers. So, don't mind my hair, you guys. It's very, very curly, if you guys can see it. I colored it and everything, and it's growing so much, and it's extremely curly. Um, so, I just woke up. I woke up like this, y'all. I just woke up like this, and it's okay. I'm all right. I'm not even tripping about the way I look right now because I'm about to get to work, and I have to take my kids to the bank to go open them some bank accounts, so got a lot to do today. Let's get started. Okay, you guys, so I literally um, have to redo this clip because I was going through my camera, and the camera said it can't dis display the file, so... I wanted to show you guys where I'm going to put our closet. So this is where we are going to put our new closet. So we're going to, at the from the edge of this window, we're going to put up a wall coming this way and then a wall going that way. I'm going to have a French door here. But I'm thinking if I put um, a wall here and just put the French door here, then I might take this door and turn it into a barn, you know, the barn style sliding door but using this door. If not, I'm going to keep this door and put the French door opening on this side of the wall. Can you guys see it? I hope I'm painting a picture. So it actually, the space looks bigger than what's actually there. It looks smaller on the camera, but yeah. So this is where our new closet is going to be. And this closet is just going to be for our um, clothing. Just all of our clothes is going to be in this closet. So I'm super excited about it. We're going to get the floors done and everything like that. But there's going to be lights in the ceiling, like a nice, beautiful chandelier. And I'm just, just excited about it because all the lighting, the natural light is going to be staying. Um, and yeah, I, I love a room with natural light. So I'm excited about our closet and that we are going to get done in the next uh, couple of weeks. And it should be really good, you guys. It's actually bigger it's it's bigger than what it, the camera's picking up i'm telling you it's larger than that but you guys will see it i'm going to have the closet system that i'm going to get from lowe's and um and put it on this wall on this wall and then the half wall because the wall is going to come out this way and then i'm going to have them build the door so this section of this wall and this section is going to be my space and then this whole section right here is going to be my husband's space. And the wall is going to come out to about here. So it's it's going to be a nice um, size closet for us. We don't need like a really large, large space. Um, but it's going, to be, it's going to be great. And then this door is a closet. That's going to be my husband's closet for all his shoes and accessories. And then this is going to be my closet for my shoes and my accessories. And they're actually large in size, um, if you can see it. Sorry, guys, it's blurry. But it's actually large in size. So it definitely could work for clothing, but... I rather use this for my shoes and my pocketbooks and all my accessories. Um, sorry. <laughs> oh, I need a new camera, you guys. So, and then I'm going to get like a pot light put up in the ceiling for my closet and also for my husband's. But just for today, until we get our closets made, um, I'm going to be unpacking and putting our clothes in our closets and getting it done so. so this is what the room looks like it's utter chaos we've kind of just been going through boxes every single day trying to find clothes to wear and it's just i've been doing laundry and kind of just piling 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 things in each box um that's that's the life of when you just move into a new place it's like you're kind of living out of boxes for a while <laughs> and i know my neighbor told me that it took them a year to unpack unpack their boxes now it's not going to take us that long because i'm literally going to get these things out today um but it, it's it's a lot it takes a lot especially because the house is so much more bigger 
I mean our livable, let me turn this camera around. Our livable space is um, 2,400 square feet. And then with the basement and the attic, once that's done, it's going to be about 4,000 square feet. So it's a huge house and we have a lot of space, a lot of storage, which I am so grateful for. Um, you know, but it's a lot more house than we're used to. So there's some empty rooms and empty spaces, which is okay. It will all be filled in and I'm going to seriously take my time to fill it all in. Um, but I just wanted to show you guys all that we have going on for today so hope you guys enjoy this vlog if you have not yet subscribed to my channel please go ahead and do so don't forget to press that bell for new um notifications and some of you have been telling me that you have not been getting the notifications make sure you go back and hit the bell and then there's going to be a pop-up box that pops up it's going to say all notifications um some notifications Make sure you hit the all notifications so that you get all the no all the videos when I do upload them, um, that you get them in your notification feed. So, yeah, please subscribe if you have not yet done so and hit the bell and don't forget to give me a like, you guys, because y'all know it helps out my channel so much. And I just miss you guys so much. Like, I literally miss doing every day regular vlogs, videos, uploads. I really do miss it because you guys are my family. And I just, I miss talking to you guys. So, I know I'm looking crazy right now. But y'all know it. I got to keep it real all the time. But anyway, I'm not going to end the vlog. I just wanted to put that piece in just now. And yeah, let's get started cleaning all this stuff up, you guys. Because... The movers are coming at 10.30 and I think it's after 8, so let's get going.
get rid of all those boxes over there some of them are still here because these are clothes and sheets and um, towels and washcloths and blankets and it's all of our clothes all five of us mixed in because most of these are clean laundry that I just laundered um, last week and this past week so most of them is what's filling um these boxes and our clothes that has to be placed in the dressers um so once the furniture guys come with the furniture then i can take our clothes out and put them where they need to go um, i'm also going to be doing the linen closet but that is going to be in a separate video and i'm also going to be doing the mud room and that's going to be in a separate video um, I did go ahead, um, I went to the thrift store, y'all know I love my thrift store, um, and stay tuned because I do have a project that I'm working on, and it's coming up in the next few weeks, and I'm so excited about it, you guys, and I'm going to make a video explain it to you, telling you all about the project, and, um, you know, hopefully you guys can support me, I would love that, but until then, I am going to... Um, I'm going to keep thrifting so I did go to the thrift store and um, I picked up a few items that I needed for the house and I got a bunch of stuff so I'm gonna do a thrift haul video for you guys coming up this week um, I've been looking for a bench for my mudroom and just haven't just was not able to find it the size and the look that I'm going for so literally, I went to the Salvation Army last week and found the exact bench that I had in my head. I, I'm telling you, I feel like whenever I think things in my head, like it just shows up, like literally just shows up. So I found the exact bench that I wanted. Um, it's a little bit scuffed up and stuff. So I'm going to do a DIY um, video on that bench and it's going to be a DIY video on the bench I just said that and <laughs> upload it and show that to you so that's all coming up this week um, and the mudroom reveal is coming up this week as well so please stay tuned you guys I have a ton I have a ton I have tons of videos that is going to be popping up this week and so on and so forth so y'all know we're getting into 
the summer it's almost the I don't want to say it's almost the end of summer because it's the end of June but you guys know like around this time this is when I start getting into like my fall you know ideas and like it just starts to drive me um, obviously I am going to put up a summer house tour probably by the end of July I don't know <laughs> but a summer house tour will come um, I'm also going to be redoing the kitchen and everything so everything in due time the bathrooms I probably won't get to the bathrooms until the end of fall maybe I don't know maybe November is when I'll get to the bathrooms um, but you know everything happens in due time but I think I'm gonna end this video here because this video is a lot I think I don't even know it's probably almost 30 minutes but I just want to tell you guys thank you guys so much for watching and I will definitely definitely um, show you guys the bedroom sets when they arrive and when the guys are coming they're on their way now they just called uh, about 20 minutes ago and said they're on their way they're about 40 minutes away so they should be here in a few and it's after 9 now and they said they'll be here about 10.30. So we'll see once they get here. I will definitely show you guys once they get here everything. All the furniture and the setup and everything like that. And just kind of take you guys um, along with me on this journey house to home. So thank you guys so much for all of your support. All of your loving you know, comments, responses, support and just tips and I'm just, I'm loving them and I appreciate you guys so much. You have no idea how much I appreciate you guys. I love y'all so much and I just thank you guys for sticking with me. You know, even though I'm not uploading as often as I should, um, y'all know I have uh, so much going on, a busy, busy life. I run a full-time daycare that is 13 hours a day with 20 kids. Um, and then I have three children, one with Down syndrome, so that's challenging in itself. Um, and then just trying to get this house together and running other things in our lives. So pray for your sister because the sister is tired, okay? But I'm loving it. I'm enjoying every moment, every single, you know, um, moment of it. So, but yeah. Anyway, let me go. I'm going to stop talking so I can finish up doing what I'm doing but I will see you guys in the next video don't forget to subscribe don't forget to hit that bell um, and hit the all notifications and don't forget to give it a thumbs up you guys and comment 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 leave your comments I love talking to y'all y'all know I respond to every single comment my husband always asks me how do you do that I just do I love talking to you guys and I feel like if you are taking your time out of your day to watch my videos and to leave comments, the least that I can do is comment back. I just, I don't know, I feel that's me. I just want to always make sure that I read every comment and that I comment back and talk to you guys and respond to all your lovely comments and feedback. So comment because I will respond absolutely res respond to you guys so thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in the next episode bye guys Two, three. i've been feeling so small watch the clock ticking off the wall but tonight I